guys, welcome back to yet another episode of Crazy Gang to Glory. If you missed the previous episode, we continued to prepare the squad for the new season. We also signed a fair few players, and today, it's the start of the season. Let's get into it. Okay, so our next game is Grimsby. Grimsby Tan, that's the first game of the season as well. Signed Kai Gordon on loan, that's brilliant. Noah Boutin's about to come in. Lovely. Now, Kai Gordon, he's not aggressive. He's the opposite of aggressive. But he's going to be one of my few exceptions to the rule, because we need him. He's pretty darn good, and we need someone in that position. So, he's going to be an exception to the rule. Alright, let's have a look at this squad now. Let's go clear. Let's try pick out our best squad. Who's still transfer listed? You two transfer offer via transfer. There we go. Okay. Anyone loan listed? We got one. James Ball. Twenty-seven eleven aggression. I'll transfer list you. I don't know why you're here at the club, but we'll transfer this to you. There we go. Okay. Uh, offer out. Transfer by transfer room. Yeah. Off the transfer value, 35k. There we go. Alright, let's have a look at the squad now. So our goalkeeper position. We signed... Oh, is he not in yet? Is he still... Okay, so we've still not signed him. Let's wait until these three are in then, actually, so we can have a look at the full squad once it's done. First game of the season, Grimsby Town. Don't know too much about Grimsby. Oh, here we go. Charlie Wiggett, signed on loan. He's not very good, but he's not that far away, and he's got brilliant potential, so... The hope is that over the season, he can get up to pace pretty quick. Okay, here we go. Press conference. It's always nice to start off with a win to get points on the board and build up some momentum. Are you confident you can get off to a good start? We've been working hard. Saturday's match sees you go up against Grimsby's newly appointed manager, Ewan Sharp. Ahead of the match, how do you feel about your chances going up against a relatively inexperienced newcomer? I think he's a terrific hire. Do you agree that Wimbledon will live or die by Bugill's performance this season? Nah. Bill is injury. He's out for a while. Well, your new signings haven't only just arrived. Um, not planned for it. Can avoid that now, that's good. Yeah, he'll find easy to settle in. Okay, that's that. Alright. Oh, here we go. Samuel had some positive things to say ahead of you. I'm a big fan of it, so it's nice to hear that. Okay, that's good. Hey, wait. You and Sharp, former. Ah, he was a coach when Rangick was at United. Interesting. Alright, well. Joe Lewis, there we go. Wrexham of MK Dons in the first match. Our big rivals for this are MK Dons, because if you're not aware, MK, this is going to be confusing to say, MK Dons used to be AFC Wimbledon before new owners came in and basically rebranded the club and moved them. So there are big rivals for this, in this series. Just, just in case you're not aware. Alright, now let's go, oh, okay, this is team selection. Let's go squad. Have you got them signings in yet? I don't think we have, have we? Nah. Shoot. That's annoying. Hey, yeah. Alright, Alex Bass, you can start. Nziga on the bench, sub one. Alright, let's have a look here now. What have we got? We got Pierce, Lewis, Wigget, Faulkner. You're just coming back from injury, so you'll be good to go. And Krasinski. Alright, let's have a look at these lot then. These are our options for the bench. We've 
we've got Pierce who has 15 aggression Krasniski 15 aggression Johnson only 11 aggression okay let's remove you Lewis 12 aggression but you're on loan so you can um, yeah we'll remove Lewis Wigget 15 aggression Faulkner 15 aggression car look at this Pure aggression there. Okay, I think we'll go. Um, all right, let's have a look here. Alex Pierce, 34, but he looks like he's the best one out of the lot. We'll compare him to Faulkner. Bobby Faulkner. Better, better, better. Worse, better, worse. Whoa, whoa. he's way slower worse physically okay if I compare him to the other two which are Krasniski yeah um, I don't even know who the other one is who's the other one one of a Charlie Wigget there we go yeah okay we'll go Faulkner and Pierce and then Wigget can be the bench player Krasniski can drop out Right, where do you, what side do you prefer to play on? No side preference. Pierce. Prefers to be on the right, okay. Faulkner. And Pierce. There we go. Alright, let's have a look at the left backs now. We've got Lee Brown, only 9 aggression. How's he got away with? Okay. A few of these are going to have to get away, unfortunately, just for the time being, because we can't really. We get this is going to be slow. We can't do everything instantly, unfortunately, because we don't have the funds. So we're going to have to take our time with this. It looks like there are options for that. Yeah. Okay, who's got higher? Vincent, right? Yeah. How much worse is Vincent than? than Johnson two worse one worse five better better same oh okay let's go Liam Vincent then why not right then at right back who do we go for it would have been Richard Tate but he signed for someone else so we could potentially go Barden Barden's an option. Who else could we go for? We could go Lewis, I suppose. 12 aggression is an option. Uh, who else have we got? I don't think we have anyone else, do we? Nah. Nah, okay. There we go. So it's between these two. We'll just... Who's got higher aggression? It's Barden, isn't it? Is Barden better? Lewis, compare, John Barden, one better, one worse, better, same, worse, better, better, same. Uh, Barden's only 20, so we'll stick with Barden. There we go, that's our back line sorted. Let's train these lot. No, all playing defender. Vincent, left back. Vincent, I'd like to make a permanent signing if he does well this season. Please, I, I got, I like Vincent. I like Vincent. Uh, okay, DM. Who do we go for? I think it was Pell before, right? I have a Pell. Oh wait, what's going on here? Ah, oh, ah, oh, hmm. Johnson can drop out for Lewis. Hopefully we can play. No, we can't. Hey, all right. We'll do that then. Okay, other DMs as an option. Jake Reeves, 15 aggression. Uh, that's the only other option, I believe, just between them two. All right, let's compare them both. I think Jake, I think Jake Reeves is going to be the one that starts, to be honest. 
Harry Pell is one worth defending, better mentally, better aerially, one worth technically, better attacking, quicker. Oh, I don't know, you know. Well, I think I like I like Pell personally, so I'm going to go Pell. What's the work rate and stamina like? 15, 14, 15. 16, 14, 14, yeah, we'll go Pell. Reeve can probably get him in the midfield, probably. All right, Charlie Lackin. Not had a chance to be caught Lackin yet. <laughs> um, yeah, he's a clear and obvious one, isn't he? He's a clear and obvious one. Surely we can terminate these loans now, right? Yes, okay. Connor, whatchamacallit, can go. That's the only one. Um, all right. Charlie Lackin is going to be given a chance because he's amazing. <laughs> um, yeah, Reeve can go in at box to box. Yeah. Unless compelled to a shift at box to box, can two and a half. What what are you like there? Yeah, okay. This is what we'll do. We'll go this here. There we go. Box to box. Advanced playmaker. Alright. Alright, alright, alright. Okay, two wingers. I think the attackers will go Gordon. Ali Al Hamadi and Zach Robinson. By the way, this is just the lineup we would go with. I know some of these are injured. This is just what would be the starting lineup. So, uh, where does Gordon prefer to play? He prefers to play on the right. Okay. We'll go Gordon on the right then and Al Hamadi on the left. Then we'll train these lot. Inside forward. Gordon likes to be an inverted winger more, so we'll let him be that at the right wing. And then Robinson are thirty only thirteen aggression. Yeah. Hopefully that'll grow because he's quite young. Alright. There's the starting squad. We need to figure out this bench now. Uh Boogiel I want to have on the bench. Amanu, why is he not registered? Whoa, Amanu has got 15 aggression. Okay. Um, who else have we got? You're listed. You've only got 8 aggression. Morgan Williams. There we go. Morgan Williams is in the squad. Good for him. Um... Lee Brown might have to go in. We uh Johnson, why are you like nah Johnson can go in. Alright, there we go. Let's have a look at Amanu here. Compare him to uh what's his name? Ali Hamadi Ali. Oh no, it is Ali Al Hamadi, okay. So same defending. He's worse mentally, worse aerially, better technically. Okay, yeah, he's a bench player. Bench player! Alright, let's go registration now. Alright, and then we just go down like this. And then all the under 21s, we unregister. Under 21, under 21. There we go. I believe that's all. Yep. Lovely. Confirm selection. I'm happy with that. I'm going to go. And when I'm back, I'll figure out all the injuries. I'll see you in a minute. Alright, alright, alright. Okay. So let's have a look at the squad here then. Zach Robinson is injured for six days to two weeks with pulled knee ligaments which means Boogiel replaces him 
which also means he needs to be replaced by a backup striker, which we don't have, because we've sold all our players. <laughs> so I think we'll just have to... What can we do? Um, what can we do? You'll have to be on the bench just for this one game. Um, okay. Then what we will do is we'll... Johnson's alright. Gordon's not yet fully fit, so we'll place you with Aminu. Rest of squad is fine. Okay, here we go. First game of the season. Alright. Squad numbers. Not yet. Oh, for crying out loud. One, two, three, four. Five. Oh, you're kidding. We've got far too many lone players in. This is not good in the slightest. We're gonna I'm gonna terminate Joe Lewis's contract. Terminate loan. Five. I need to get rid of two more players, are you kidding? Alright, you can go. Oh, it's already been terminated. There we go. We just won over now. Wiggett's going to have to stay on the bench. Oh, I'm actually fuming about that, you know. I'm really not happy with that. I've got four players on my bench now. Oh, for poo and poo. Okay, we can put Brown and Nightingale. Oh, Nightingale. I've completely forgot about him. Compare Nightingale to Faulkner. Better, 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 same, 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 worse, worse. Oh, okay, I'll go fuck Nightingale then. No, I won't be the first player on the right. Um, alright. Have I got anyone else? No. Krasinski can go in there. Alright, now we go to squad numbers. Uh, Alex Baskin number one. Faulkner can be number five. Pierce is number four. We're doing this the old fashioned way. John Barden's number two. And Liam Vincent is number three. Number six is Reeves. Number eight is Pell. Number ten is Charlie Lackin. Uh, number nine isn't available. Kai Gordon would be our. Number 11, Ali Al Hamadi's number 7, and it will auto number the rest. Lovely. The number 9 is available. Okay. Submit numbers. Go to the match. Come on. First match of the season. Let's make it a good one. Let's make it a good one. So, there's their lineup. I. Don't actually know any of them lot. So we'll go dressing room. Point finger. I expect a win today. I'm gonna try and make reason lacking, not complacent. Once they could performance, they're still complacent. Alright, here we go. Come on, what's their lineup looking like? It's a 4 3 3 from Grimsby. And here's our lineup. 4 3 3 as well. Come on. S. Gavin. S. B. Avenue. Uh, encourage. Now I need to change the settings on it, don't I? Key highlights. That. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, there we go. Here we go. Vincent's on the ball. Barden throwing to Pell. Pell to Reeves. Faulkner. Faulkner boots it up the field to Boogil. Barden. Pierce. Barden to Pell. P 
help held with it to Faulkner. Vincent to Lackin. Vincent again. Down the wing. Crosses it in. Come on! 1 0. Get in there! Brilliant header. We're 1 0 up. Come on! Have a look at this replay here. Gives it to Vincent. Vincent runs down. What a good cross. Pinpoint perfect. Praise the team. Come on. Uh, what's going on there? Let's praise again. Not much has happened since then. We've got three shots in total, one shot on target. We've got an expected goal of 0 0.25. We've had a majority of the possession though. Here we go, Pierce. Boots up and we've lost it. Cannot seem to get the ball. They've booted out of the field, they're through on goal. And they scored. Is it offside? No. Okay, that's 1 1. It's 1 1. We've been caught out there. Here's a fault for that. So, waterfall. Yeah. Faulkner just lost him. Faulkner completely lost him. Hey, we'll get back up there. Come on, Faulkner. To Lackin. To Vincent. Vincent plays up to Al Hamadi. Faulkner. Vincent. Plays it four to Al Hamadi. Who's booted it in. Boogie, oh, come on. Get in! Second goal, come on. Oh, are you kidding? It's been called offside. <sighs> Have a look here. You can't even see the player. Hey yo. Right, come on. We're on again. Pell. Go on, Pell. Just over. Okay. We had five shots to four. Two shots on target. Majority possession. Here we go, Lackin. To Al Hamadi. Plays it to Reeves. To Pell. Pierce, out to Barden, to Pell, and we've lost the ball. Penalty! Get in! We've got a penalty! Come on, Pell. Will he pelter it into the back of the net? Come on. Got a corner out of it. Come on, putting a good cross lacking. Nope, straight out of the other end. Oh, is he gonna? No, that's out. All right, we're still on the attack though. This is good. Still on the attack. Forty-four minutes in. No, we're not not anymore. Oh, okay, Barden. Here we go to Pierce. Last attack of the half. Lacking. Rees. Faulkner plays up to Lackin. Reeves boots up to Al Hamadi. He's running down the wing. Oh, he's done well there. That's the aggression we're after. Vincent. Go on, lad. Oh, that was a corker. Not from Faulkner. That was a corker. Right, uh, we won't encourage him yet. Lackin takes the corner. Come on. Straight past everyone. Boogiel's got it. Boots it all the way back to Vincent. And that's half time. Okay, not bad. Uh, I'm going to point at them. I'm going to tell them to keep going. That's done nothing. Uh, okay. 
Always praise them at half time. Always, always praise them. All right. Second half, here we go. Everyone's still fairly fit. We'll encourage them. They've had five shots, Grimsby, but they've got a 0 0.1 XG, which is expected goals. We have a 1.32 expected goals, so we should be beating them, realistically. There's nothing else, they just should be beating them. We look at the match momentum here. We've had momentum for large parts of the game. Here we go, Vincent to Lackin. Lackin plays it back to Faulkner, up to Vincent. He plays the central to Pell. And Pell's lost the ball. Oh no. Come on, get it back. Vincent, no, Vincent! Yes, well in. Faulkner, he's done well there. Vincent, Vincent can't keep up with him. Don't go in. Oh, it's just over. Alright, I'm going to copy there. Then we're going to make a few changes. I'm going to change the opposition instructions. I'm also going to bring off uh, Vincent. I think he's had a good shift, but he's a bit knackered. And I'll bring off Al Hamadi. We'll give Gordon his debut. Let's give Gordon his debut and we'll move Amanu to left wing. Alright, I'm happy with that. Come on. Come on. Encourage. Pell's next in line to come off because he's yellow and 6.4 and knackered. Uh, okay. Pell's got the ball. Back to Pierce. Pierce plays it back to the keeper. Keeper plays it forward to Faulkner. He plays it. Oh, Faulkner's lost the ball. No, we can't. This can't be happening. Oh my god. Alright. We're changing up attacking. We're bringing Pell off for Williams. And we're bringing Barden off for... We can't bring Barden off. Okay. Uh, can Reeves play right back? No. Can Pierce, surely Pierce can play right back, right? No. Can anybody in this team play right back? Lee Brown can. And then Johnson can go left back. Oh man, okay. All right, here we go, and we're going attacking. Come on, come on. Fire them up. We're going very attacking, screw it. We're going for the win here. We should have won this game. How on earth we haven't, I don't know. Come on. Surely we get one more chance. No? That's game. Oh, how on earth have we drawn that? How on earth have we drawn that? We really should have won that game. Uh, so that leaves us in 11th. 11th place, okay. There we go, these two loans are done now. So we need to make a fair few signings now. Whether they're rubbish or not, we just need to make signings. You drew with Ewan Sharp despite his lack of experience and relatively brief time. Why are we not able to win today? We won't look proudly on this match. We outclassed them in every department, but somehow fluked a result. There we go. Bugio got his first goal for the club today. Is he new? Oh, he is, from Sutton. All right. Nice, good for him. Great moment for Omar. All square in your first competitive match without a missed opportunity to start with a win. I think a win would have been fair. Aminu had a torrid time out there. What are your thoughts on his performance? Um, it wasn't great, but we won't worry just yet. Uh, really? You score one goal and give him a 7.7? .7. Thought he was decent. Okay. Uh, what was I going to do now? Oh yes, free agent signings. Desperately, have we got any more signings coming in? Yes, okay, so we'll bring these two signings in. And once they're in, we'll chuck all the transfer budget on the wage budget. And we'll see who we can get in. 
because we need numbers. Oh, you're kidding. Oh, here we go. Having spoken with Andreas Sondergaard, he's made, he's made clear that he's unwilling to complete his transfer to us after his application for a British work permit was rejected. He has, however, indicated that he'd be willing to discuss the issue with you, so it may be possible to persuade him to change his mind and complete the move. Oh, okay, let's go through all the options here. We need to think carefully. Hey, what's up? I believe you should reconsider your decision and join the club. We have a long-term placing plan that would involve you going on loan until you're able to get a work permit. That sounds good to me. I suggest you think again and join the club. I believe you stand a good chance of getting a work permit. If... Nah, no, that's not the right move. I really think you should reevaluate your decision and join the club. You're really keen to move before... Nah, no, that's not going to work. I'm of the view you should reassess your decision and join the club. Work permit on no missing chance. Nah, that's not right. My opinion is you should review your decision and join your club. We're trying to address the work permit problems, but you're genuinely wanted here, which is more than can be said for you. We'll go with the top one. That doesn't have much appeal to me, I'm afraid. I really urge you to think again. We'd love to have you on board. Damn! I'm out. It's nothing personal. I just haven't been convinced by your efforts. I'm disappointed with what has happened here and I don't see any reason to continue talking. Oh, man. Why can't I allocate him a ESC place? Do they not exist in League 2? Guess not. That's really disappointing. He had brilliant potential as well, didn't he? Yeah. Decent, ah, oh, decent Skybet Championship player. Oh, man. Okay. Well, that's very disappointing. We got booting in. That's another left back. Okay. Oh, man. Okay. Well, move to scene squad. Are there any players that join gone into the under 21s? If they have, I'd like them to come up. James Tilly's gonna rot away. Sasu? Nah. Sasu we could sell, you know. What's his sky bit? Oh, nah. We'll let, we'll let him sit there. 11 aggression on Sutcliffe. Paris Lock, 7. Campbell, 10. 12 aggression on Josh Hallard. Okay. One to keep an eye out on. Matthias Tepe. I'm going to call up Josh Hallard. Because numbers. We need them. Alright. How many loanees have we got in the squad now? If they all let me go here. We have... Uh, let me go squad view then. Alright, we have one, two, three, four, five, six. Any of these I'm willing to let go of? Nah, I'm alright with that though. Okay, let's go to. We'll just acknowledge that. Let's go players in range. We'll go contract expired. And we'll pick attributes, aggression, and stamina. 20. 19. 18. 17. Here we go. Don't know who you lot are, but we will scout you and hopefully you join. And to shortlist. 16. Here we go. Now they're rolling in. The numbers are coming in. Oh, he's got the best view for. Right, add to shortlist. Fully scout. There we go. And then we'll go 15. This is as low as I'm willing to go. There is Kenny Davis. Kenny Davis? You what? Where's he been? Sutton? Armbra? 
He's been in Van. Yeah, okay, we're not bringing him in. Um, Ethan Slater, who's at Sheffield? Okay. Ethan Slater will fully scout. And Luke Mer no, not Luke Merrill. Uh, where was he? Will Couch, who's this guy? Burnley. Okay, we'll add you to the shortlist to scout you. Right, here we go. So these are a bunch more players we're going to wait on. Hopefully they will be good numbers. Let's have a look at... Um, ooh. Solomon Kalu is interested in joining. This would be a brilliant transfer if we could get him in. The won't require a transfer fee. Thanks for feedback. Okay. Important player. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nice and easy. We could have just... We might have just got... Lyle Taylor in at the club, by the way. Oh, wait. What's his aggression? Oh. Nah, let's withdraw the contract offer. I, I've got a bit carried away there. I forgot about the... I forgot about the whole aggression thing. Alright, Lyle Taylor. We can have a look at the players, though. Winston Reed. See, Winston Reed has got 14 to 19 aggression. I shortlist him. Fully scout. Simpson, 10 to 17. Do we need a right back? We could do with another right back. Uh, what else have we got here? Okay. There's a lot of players here that I didn't think there would be. 4 to 9, 9 to 13, 5 to 10. Rob Elliott is a goalkeeper player slash technical director at Gateshead. Um, hmm. We don't need a keeper though. Connor Wickham, 30 year old striker. Add to shortlist. Oh, what's his aggression like? 8 to 12. Mm, maybe not then. Alright, Umar Niasse. 14 aggression. Shortlist you. Scott Dan. 10 to 14. Shortlist you. Surely these players aren't actually interested, are they? Matty Longstaff. Nah. Uh, scrolling down the list Roshan Williams no Reese Devine no no uh, let's go here like this and then let's go here ability J Emmanuel Thomas no Tim Tandy, no. Uh, Matt Ollison, there we've had a look at already. No, I'm happy with all this for now. I'm happy with these lot. Yeah, that's alright. Okay, let's go international and cats. Robert Snodgrass. That could be a brilliant signing. Ah, uh, um, okay. I'll offer a trial then for a couple of weeks. I don't think there's anyone else. We'll go transfer value, have a look. Uh, Glenn McConnell. 13 aggression, 18 year old striker. Okay, okay. Glenn McConnell. We've got Ryan Rydell. Only 6 to 10. Uh, who else have we got? Benny Kuto. Portuguese at there. 9 to 16 aggression. Okay. Let's add to shortlist and fully scout. Okay, there we go. So we're going to end the episode there. We got one game done. 
We got one game done. We drew 1-1 one, one against Grimsby in the opening game. We've also shortlisted a load of... Wait. We got one game done. We drew against Grimsby 1-1. One, one. We also shortlisted a bunch of players, as you can see here. Loads. They look good as well, like... We can remove Sondergaard. Bardsley, ex-Burnley player. Uh, if we go further down, Winston Reid, West Ham, ex-Premier League player. Danny Simpson, Premier League winner. Scott Dan, Crystal Palace player, ex-Crystal Palace player. Snodgrass has been around for blooming donkeys. So I'm happy with that. Alright, we will end the video there. If you enjoyed, make sure to like and subscribe. If you enjoy this episode, make sure to check the previous ones. I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.